Welcome to our MSA Gear Talk. My name is Malte. I'm product manager at MSA. Today I'm going to show you how our M1 SCBA with its modular approach prepares you for the future. The M in M1 stands for modularity, a modularity that allows you to fit the M1 SCBA to your individual needs. Because that is what you told us when we talked to you during many visits and customer surveys. The M1 modularity allows you to purchase the SCBA you need and can afford today, but at the same time you can easily adapt it to future requirements whenever needed and upgrade the system directly in the field. One of the most important contact points between you and your SCBA is the harness. The M1 offers two different harness options. The advanced harness for high carrying comfort due to the wide shoulder pads and the basic variant without any pads. Both variants are available with metal or plastic buckles and made out of water repelling material. The advanced harness offers the comfortable padded hip belt for best in class weight distribution and varying comfort. Additional D-rings can be mounted into the harness to attach accessories such as thermal imaging cameras or smoke hoods. The cylinder retainer strap offers you to mount a single cylinder or a twin cylinder option. For both options, you can select between a plastic or a metal buckle. The next important component, and probably the most important one, is the backplate. There is only one basic backplate for all versions of the M1 SCBA. It offers an ergonomically optimized S-shaped design that has already integrated hose routings to reduce snagging hazards. The M1 backplate can easily be upgraded with multiple pneumatical options to improve your safety during demanding incidents. You can add, for example, a second medium pressure connection or MSA's Clean Connect. Multiple accessories can easily be upgraded, like the bumper, the rescue handle, the swiveling hip belt, or the innovative height adjustment. There is only one pressure reducer for all options of the M1 SCBA. The reducer with its medium pressure connection ports on each side or the two single line ports on the top is already prepared to either fit single line or classic line pneumatics. You can then choose from a variety of classical gorges like this one or go for electronic options such as the single line scout or my personal favorite, the M1 control module with its fully integrated color display. All those options can be assembled or disassembled without special tools, allowing you to easily build up your own personal M1 SCBA. After speaking about the SCBA and its high pressure reducer, let's focus on the M1 lung governed demon valve and its options. There are two types of connection to mount the LGDV to the backplate. The first one is fixed to the medium pressure line. Or the second option, which I actually hold in my hands, is the standalone version with a standard coupling. The M1 LGDV of course supports MSAs, common face mask interfaces, the PS Max, push to connect, or the M45 by 3 round threaded connector. On top of the M1 LGDV and the M1 backplate, the G1 face piece with its low profile as well as different sizes for the inner and outer mask paired with your favorite harness options offers best carrying comfort. The G1 mask integrates all connection types for the M1 LGDV. The mask itself has just been updated with the possibility to directly mount the C1 headset. Let's have a short recap. The modularity of the M1 allows you to configure your SCBA in correlation with today's budget. And you can easily upgrade your SCBA whenever possible and needed. All this makes the M1 your modular platform for the future. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please also check out our other Gear Talk videos and please do not hesitate to send us your questions via email. Thanks for watching.